Flood season is here in Louisville and MSD is working to make sure crews are prepared. WKY's Manash Gwengwari shows us the training designed to keep the community safe. Every three years, at least five of Louisville's 79 movable flood closures have to be replaced. On Tuesday, these Metro Sewer District crew members spent time training how to install a new flood wall closure. It's a training exercise that most often is given to new employees their first month on the job. MSD's Operation Director for Flood Protection, Dane Anderson, says it's extremely critical. Think of the levee system. You think of the flood walls, these closures are one section of that whole system. A system that in late February of 2018 went through one of the biggest floods in city history. 40 billion gallons of water flooded the metro. Anderson says nine closures had to be replaced as a result just to stop the destruction. Just like any first responder does protecting the community, that's what we're doing here. We're protecting the community from disaster. Crews also spend time working on the sandbag machine, a machine that at full capacity can make about 1,200 sandbags an hour. Leaders say out of all the equipment in here, it might be the most important one. The sandbags is, is the known method for blocking water in a flood event. There's a seal on the bottom of those movable closures where this sets against. The seal gets folded up against the closure. The sandbags then press that seal in to help seal off the water from leaking through our movable closures. Anderson says this training is an all-hands-on-deck approach to make sure all of the Metro's community members, 137,000 structures, and $34 billion worth of property are protected. We're ready for that flood event and flood fight. In Louisville, Manaj Kungwari, WLKY News. MS